You recall back on August 10th, the car accident almost took the lives of Oakland County Executive L. Brooks Patterson and his driver. Well, now 12 weeks later, Patterson is back on the job. And tonight he has invited Action News reporter Kim Russell into his home to talk about his efforts to get back on his feet. I'll be uh, standing in a few days. I won't be a pillar of strength, but I'll be a pillar. Oakland County Executive Al Brooks Patterson invited Seven Action News into his home to talk about his recovery. He says his daughter helped him put his struggles into perspective. He said, Dad, they gave you chances of survival between 3 and 10 percent. His daughter was with him as he returned to work this week. He says most people welcomed him back, but some did try to turn his injuries into a political issue. They asked if he was in a coma for 17 days after this accident because he suffered brain trauma. They asked if he was fit to serve. On my healthiest day last year, when I could actually run a marathon, people said, is he fit to serve? <laughs> so uh, that's the nature of the game. I'm fine. Patterson says that the coma, which the public was not told about until this week, was medically induced. That doctors at McLaren Hospital in Pontiac drugged him so he would not experience intense pain while he recovered from broken wrist, hip, leg, knee and ankle bones. What do you say to people who say the public should have known just how serious it was exactly? It's not a topic of conversation. It just comes up in interviews. Also I have a basic right to some um, privacy. Elbrooks Patterson did make some renovations to his home to assist him during his recovery. But he says when it comes to maintaining a passion for his job, no assistance is needed even after this accident. Uh, you'll see. Oakland County won't miss a beat. He only expects two to five more weeks of intense physical therapy. Couldn't raise my leg up before. So you can see the progress. For now, he is enjoying a renewed appreciation of life and family. Never, I'm never going to miss an opportunity to let those who I love know that. Kim Russell, 7 Action News. You know, politics aside, a lot of people are happy to see him on the mend, you know? Yeah, it's uh, and, and he's, he's looking, I think, remarkably well for what he's gone through. Absolutely. And so we wish him a speedy recovery and again, uh, becoming that pillar of strength again. We're just